Good afternoon from North Texas. How y'all doing? Time check is 1738 or 538 daylight savings time, whatever we're in now. 92 degrees. We are heading out to the gun club. <clears throat> Our buddy Robert and a couple of guys are uh, going out there to adjust the lights over our skeet fields. We have three fields and the lights need adjusting. So uh, being the, uh, uh, we call it dirty hands, rednecks that we are, uh, we're gonna go out there and fix it ourselves instead of uh, paying somebody to come out there and do it. So we're heading out there. <clears throat> And uh, I'm gonna get a little bit of video of it, I guess. And uh, we're gonna keep this on the down low. We're gonna see uh, the Skeet League starts tomorrow night, I believe. I believe that's right. Or was it last week? Anyway, uh, I don't shoot the weekly Skeet series. Uh, I go out there and just kind of knock the rust off, get ready for dove season. But anyhow, uh, we're gonna go out there and adjust the lights and. Uh, some of them are not even close. Some are kind of close. Uh, this is the report I got from Robert. So we're uh, kind of doing it on the down low. Uh, and we didn't ask for permission. We'll ask for forgiveness later if somebody says anything. But uh, we're gonna see if uh, any of the members even pay any attention. But uh, I, I normally don't go out there in the evening. I, I'm real, I spend most of my time on the pistol range or the rifle range, but uh, I go out there and shoot some skeet every now and then for the fun of it. So, here we go. We're heading east at a whopping eight miles an hour. Yeah. East of Dallas, they're building houses. They're like mushrooms. You drive by there and the next day there's houses. Uh, on 30 and 80 heading east. Uh, people are, I remember people saying 20, 30 years ago, the mass exodus from Dallas. It, not as bad as it is now. Uh, it, it is just housing everywhere. And needless to say, our roads are behind. Uh, I think our, my real estate buddy up there, uh, the Swede said uh, 100,000 moving to Dallas, Dallas area every month, something, something like that. Anyway, it's just a tremendous number. And you could tell by a lot of the plates that uh, are around that are, they're not Texas. So anyhow, uh, we got a lot of people. All I can say is welcome. But leave all your liberal politics where you come from, or it'll be just, it, you'll turn our state, don't tell, don't turn our Texas into your California. So, anyhow, it's a political rant over. We're heading out here to do a little work. I'm not, probably not going to do much work, kind of supervised, but uh, got a pair of hands if they need them. See you guys. I'll uh, try to get some of this recorded. Uh, it, uh, hopefully everything will go really smooth and won't be a problem. If not, maybe I'll video it and it'll be spectacular. But we're really leaning towards nothing happening. So here we go. I'll get it recorded and uh, we'll try to get this posted. Probably won't get it posted tonight because there are some of the uh, gun club members that, that are subscribers, so we'll, uh, we'll want them to be surprised. So here we go. Well, here we are at the Rifle and Pistol Club. Pulling in the gate. It's 25 yard, there's some pistols over to your left. Two hundred is hard right, way down the other uh, end down there.
you guys here. Huh? Somebody's shooting. And back here's the old clubhouse that's going to get torn down, and we're building a brand new. There you go after a final adjustment. I think it's beautiful. And if you can't hit the birds, 